Hello everyone. Let's. I'm going to play Little Playmates from Suzuki Book One right the way through, and then we can talk about how to improve on it. Please remember that the podcast does normal normalize volumes, so it's really hard to get um, subtle differences, but you'll get the overall effect. One, two, three, four. When you play it, you would repeat that final section where the repeat marks are at the end, and you go back to the loud section and that lovely contrast. I don't think there was any need for me to do it. So let's talk about what's involved. The left hand is quite um, similar to a lot of the things we've been doing. We've got no new notes to, to um, worry about. What we've really got to worry about is differences in pressure. Um, and that's very difficult, actually, on an electric guitar, uh, electric piano, especially if your piano isn't touch sensitive. So you, you may have to upgrade your piano, I'm afraid. You want, as best you can, to get the most expensive instrument possible. And that usually means, well, it always means a t at least, a very, at the very least, a touch sensitive um, instrument. I can, on this instrument, I can actually alter the sensitivity of my notes. So I may um, change mine a little bit because I, I haven't found it as woefully inadequate, actually, for these wonderful contrasts, the differences between the mezzo piano and the piano. And later on we'll get double P and triple P, which is really quiet, so it's pretty hard. I would tend to use the pedal to fill, fill the sound a bit more, so it's a sort of cheater's way um, of, of increasing the volume because what you're allowing the strings to do is to resonate for longer so it, it kind of, there's a build up so it, it it works for increasing the sense of volume and the width of of the tones and things like that.